So here at Cosmetology at RVCC, we do not job train, we career train. As a former owner of two hair salons, um, I really have a first hand in seeing what quality comes out of cosmetology school. Being on the advisory board for many years for RVCC, I have had a first hand in actually developing this new curriculum. Part of what we actually do, which differentiates from other schools to us, is actually testing on employability skills. We had a employer panel, so we understand what needs to be done in school and what needs to be done out of school. So the type of student that we're looking for is a serious student, not somebody who just thought of this as a second choice, but somebody who really wants to pursue this for their future. We also went to two hair shows this year. We took a, a few classes at day and night. Uh, very hands-on, uh, things I thought I would never learn and things I thought I would never like. I chose RVCC because at the time it was financially available for me. It's really close and I heard nothing but great things. The programs, the classes that they give us as opportunities to network ourselves in this industry and grow as a stylist is amazing and it just caught my interest and caught my eye and the fact that it was 10 minutes from my house, I couldn't say no. I would definitely choose RVCC because I went to school here. Um, it made me the stylist that I am. I have my own business now. I started off in a very, you know, old salon with not that many experienced people and I feel like I helped them and I just realized when I left here that I was pretty good already and then it only got better as I learned more but I just respect the school I went here the teachers are really good so and I competed myself against other girls from other schools that were more expensive or more you know high-end per se schools and I beat them so it's a good program here good teachers good education my most memorable experience in this salon in this classroom has to be Fridays because Fridays you went from doing your mannequins or working in a book to all of a sudden you're busy all the time with the clients and you're just scrambling with everyone and trying to figure out what's going on and it, it really does bring you into what the salon world is going to be like. I chose this school because I did go to another school and I saw what was going on and I honestly didn't learn anything. I was there for what six months and what I learned in that six months doesn't even compare to what I learned in this school for the first month. But what made me actually choose this school is the fact that I actually could go in for an interview and sit down and become a candidate to actually get into the school. So it showed that not just anyone can walk off the street, sign up for cosmetology and say, okay, well here I am. You actually have to want to be in this field to come to this school. I'm really excited about all the students that are really coming out. I've had a chance to work with many, many of them over the last couple of years. And I really think that, you know, the next generation is going to be really great. I hope to uh, always get at least one student per year out of each one of their classes. Um, I can't say enough good things about the school. We do find that with the students or the future stylists from, that come in from RVC. They always know the proper attire, and like I said, they're always on time. Um, and there's an eagerness to, to better their career. So at Raritan Valley Community College, we're in the business of education. So with that in mind, we can take the private sector best practices along with the public best practices and converge them with the employability skills that our employers are asking for. So when I talk about employability skills, our employers today say that the students are lacking the social graces and the work ethic that's needed in the salon business. So we make sure that these employability skills or better known as soft skills are being taught and measured on a regular basis. And hopefully in the end, we're preparing a student that translates into the workforce with exceptional work ethics. Our job placement process really involves meeting with the salon owners, getting an understanding of their culture, and then in the end, finding a salon match for the students. Our program teaches beyond the curriculum, and I truly believe that there are students out there that have a passion for this industry, that have a creative element, that will wanna to come to our program so that they too can help to elevate the standards of our industry.